highly anticipated rematch between UST and De La Salle University. A huge game on our hands between these two teams. La Salle chasing their 10th UAAP title. Meanwhile, UST looking for retribution. Positions such as Shannon Arthur, striker, now center mid, the center back, Shallow Hodges, and also the other center back. Christina Montalivan is usually a wing back, actually now both playing inside, but you could see they're adjusting really well. Delivery into the box. It's a dangerous one, and it's a goal! Straight in from Kyla Quick, <laughs> and it is the opener for De La Salle University. Beautifully well taken free kick by Kyla Inquig of it. Sent it into the danger zone. What a beauty. Nicole Reyes unable to get her hands to it. Bothered by the crowd in front of her. And just like that, the scoring has opened. You see a little bit of Ronaldo-inspired <laughs> celebration for Kyla and King. <laughs> and Quig gets around her defender. Tries to switch it on the other flank. Well cut out. Lemoran now with the ball. USD Very ball. dangerous on the ball. Oh. What a reverse pass. She's onside. Equalizer, USD. And just like that, again, you can see Lemoran brings them on that right side. Onside. Onside. Switches the ball to Shalame. Kadag and oh, what a cool collected finish by Shalame Kadag. Her eighth goal so far this season. Ariel Tejada caught napping there. Did not see that Kadag was behind her. And she. Tejada wins that one. Andaya cuts inside. Continues her run. And kick takes over. Lovren shot. What a goal! What a goal from Kyla and kick puts LaSalle back in front. Yeah, and it's very dangerous to give Kyla and kick the time and space on that ball. You can see the ball is left behind. Four players surrounding her, but no one really approaching Kyla. Once she saw that goal, just took in that long range effort, and the rest was history. Credit must go to Nicole and Daya as well. She fought hard to get the ball to Inkig. The La Salle crowd making themselves heard. One look at the watch. Another great effort by Kyla and Kig and making sure that's the last play. La Salle now. Back-to-back -back champion season 79 and season 80. You really have to give it to Coach Hans, how he was able to work around with his players. Again, as I said, a couple of players were not playing their natural positions, but somehow they were able to really shape.